Let's fuck me now. Looking back is how God took a little girl's dream of being an athlete. Probably the least likely person to ever perform this dream. But how he was cognizant of the dream and how I never thought it would to become reality. Tony's testimony should take one. <laughs> My spiritual journey started at a young age. I remember from my birthday I took five or six. My parents used to drop me at church. Um, at the age of about 12, I was privileged to leave the school where I was in PE and enter Christians were where I really felt that I grew in my path and was disciples and I had an amazing supervisor slash teacher who became the spiritual mother one of the most challenging parts of my journey was coming to terms with my whole birth situation and knowing that we serve all powerful and omnipresent God but still, for many years, I thought he didn't intervene in the whole birth process, and it caused a lot of anger, questioning, and one day, fairly recently, Maybe a year or two ago, I felt him say that the way that you are alive, he did intervene in that situation, although not the way we thought he should, but in his own way he was. There and it did intervene in his way. And with further ado, I declare 2017 UCI Press Hacking Road World Championship officially open. A major, major team in my life has been the desire to participate in sport. I started with fighting at around four or five years old, this part of my physical therapy. It, it didn't really fulfill my desire because it was more healthy and not competitive enough for me in a sense. At that point it felt like the end of so much more than was standing because there was 
Viele wollen Pässchen in Lauf zu öffnen. Ja, ähm, ich tue in den Jutzwinkel. Das Ding mit mir in der Pfund in Nest startet Training, wo ich kein Klammete weiß. Und mit den nächsten sechs Mals meine ich die Dickes mal West Ham so krass dass der Organizer auf der Liga ist sie aus mir zu konzentrieren in den National Championships the next year. 2017 was the year I had been aiming for. I knew that in three years time the World Championships would be in South Africa and so we now she got into the team for World Champs. It was enough. I had reached my goal and was happy. Once again, God just came and blew my expectations. Just last week I received yet another email saying that I am one of five paracyclists who have been selected to represent South Africa, South Africa in the European World Cup in 2018. This is an absolute, absolute dream come true.